Welcome to Spanish Antics. So this is just a quick little bit uh, about my hotted up NC50. Had it about five, six years maybe. Uh, it's been stashed at the back of my garage at home and forgotten about. Until the other day I needed to move some cars around. So I thought I'd just jump on the little bike and bring that to work. So I just thought I'd do a little bit. Should we have a look around? Here I am where the movie started Facing at a photo they've taken Space tree flying through the skies And battles happen everywhere So, here she is. She is a 1979 NC50. They were created for the domestic market for housewives to escape the house in the late 70s. Sit in your own home Shopping only two feet Never see your own friends this isn't the stock one though. So let's look at some of the mods we've done. Start at the back. Number one, put a bit of a bigger knobbly tyre on there because it gets used a bit on grass when we go camping. Two stroke pipe. A 70 big bore kit. Nice little pressed alley plate and a carb upgrade. Different inlet to go with the better carb, and then it's also got twin carbon reed valves. So, this thing, oh, yeah, and cylinder head temperature. I've seized one before, one of the system valves. So, this thing from the factory, it says here, rated for. 25 miles an hour. Now I've had this thing a bit quicker. So basically I built this little bike as a bit of a uh, bit of fun really. I thought it'd be funny to see whether I could get a bike that was built to do 25 miles an hour to do 50 miles an hour. Now we've got pretty close on the old GPS. We've uh, we've hit 48 miles an hour on the GPS. 48, 49. Problem is, at around mid to high 30s, it gets a bit of speed wobble, which you have to then push through. Uh, it's pretty much death trap. It's very cool though. Shall we uh, take for a little spin? Come on in. <laughs> to fire this bad boy up, she's actually a wind up start. Oh, yeah. Right. Here we are. I'm a hundo. Thing is sketchy with one hand. Oh, where's my mate? <laughs> you got two hands. <laughs> Ready?
So, that's the Honda, NC50. A uh, little ripper. Hope you enjoyed it. You go back in the shed now, probably for another four years, where it will sit and gather dust. But hey, uh, if you like what you see, please subscribe. The more subscribers I get, the more content I can do, which would be amazing. Uh, cool. Take it easy.